kid. Seriously. Hey, Luke. Hey, what? Back in the day, they made an obligatory third movie in the trilogy for Spider-Man. Spider-Man 3! Have you seen the trailer? I have seen the trailer. Oh, man. It brought back a lot of fun nostalgia for how excited I was for this movie. Spider-Man 2 was one of the greatest action movies I had seen up until then because it was about characters and this trailer shows you a lot of character development and things happening with them and it looks like a real emotional battle they seem to leave out the part with you know emo dance off sequences no dance off yeah and you know at least Spider-Man still takes his mask off constantly but boy this is something that it, it almost pained me to watch it again because I was like oh yeah I was really excited for this yeah. and it was so bad yeah and I think the part that hurts the most well, except that other thing. That hurts the most. But the part that hurts the second most is that Venom looks so cool in this. Like, it looks awesome. They do a great job. And in the movie, they flub it so bad. Well, because you don't even really see Venom in it. You just right. see Spider-Man with a symbiote suit. So it's it, it does so many things right in the trailer that the movie doesn't even come close to doing. Also, one of my critiques in the trailer is how they represent the Sandman, who I think is actually the best part about that actual movie. And in this, he looks stupid. You know, they give the uncle's actual killer, even though we both saw the first one and, and saw that that was not his uncle's actual killer. And, I mean, going into this movie, I was rolling my eyes at Sandman and could not get enough of the idea of Venom. And in the movie, it was actually... Do you think flipped. that sand effect at the time looked really good? Yeah, I did. can't remember. Okay. Because now it looks bad, but it's right. 20 years old or, you know, 15 years old or whatever it is. So I was, I was sitting there thinking, wow, that reminds me of watching Brendan Fraser mummy movies. But at the time, it probably was pretty impressive. I never saw the Brendan Fraser mummy movies. But... Get drunk and find a drive-in.